Hello. Today we are creating verification system for our social media app. Let's start. Firstly, I will change this text to admin and make conditional visibility that only admin can see it. This helps when I try to figure out that which account I'm on. Then go to your Firebase collections and add new field to user's collection. This will be account verified. And data type will be Boolean. Then add second one, which will be account verification pending. And this will also be Boolean. Then we can go to our authentication page. Add those fields in Create Document Action. Switch this to Account Verified. And this Account Verification Pending. And make sure both of these are set as a false. Great! Now I have this page already, which I don't use. I will use it as a template. I will name this page as Verify. Then start to remove everything in here so we are left with blank canvas. Perfect. Then add app bar so we have navigate back button set up. Now for the blank canvas. Firstly, I am going to add column, then text. Make the text black. And then we need couple buttons. Now let's make this column scrollable and position it to center of the canvas. Then edit the text how many followers you need before you can apply for verification. For this example, I'm only going with one follower. Then separate these items a bit and rename this button as Verify. We can delete this other button and duplicate the one above. Now I'm going to change this button's color to gray so it indicates that it's not active. Okay, perfect. Now it's time to go to our profile page. We can remove this verification animation. After that, add icon to this row. Change the icon to be verification icon. And the color should be blue. Add conditional visibility to that icon. Single condition. Authenticated user. Account verified. Is equal to true and confirm. Then let's duplicate this icon button. And move it up on this row. And change the navigation to verify page. And for this icon button, we can also change the icon. Then we are going to add conditional visibility. Single condition. Authenticated user. Account verified is equal to false. And confirm. Then we can take a copy of this icon. Go to our home page and paste it in here. Let's position this icon to the left. And we also need to paste it in the list view below.
Delete this conditional visibility and add a new one. In this one, open up the user's document and click on account is verified is equal to true and close. Then copy this conditional visibility and paste it into this icon. And again, choose the account is verified and confirm. Now go to verify page. Let's add conditional visibility to this gray button. Single condition. Authenticated user. Users following me. Number of items. Is less than one and confirm. Then add conditional visibility to the blue button. Again, single condition and users following me. Number of items is greater than or equal to one and confirm. Now add action to this button. This will be update document. Authenticated user, user reference, then switch this to verified pending, equal to true. Then add navigation to home page. And also show snack bar that indicates the user that their request has been sent. Now go to admin panel. Add a new tab in here. We will call this verification. Delete this and copy and paste list view from the other page. Take a copy of this icon button and paste it back in here. Then change this icon to be checkmark. Delete the previous actions from both of these buttons. Then create a new one to the verified side. This will be user's document, user's reference. Add two fields in here. First field will be account verified. The second will be verified pending. Switch the verified to true and verified pending to false. Then take a copy of this action chain and paste it into the delete button. Delete the account verified action and this one you can leave at false. Then go to your profile page. Take a copy of this icon. Then go to search profile page. Wrap this text into a row and paste it in here. Delete this conditional visibility and create a new one. Single condition. Users document. Account is verified. Is equal to true and confirm. Then for the last thing, go back to your admin panel. Click this list view and add filter to this user's query. Filter is verification is pending. Must be equal to true and confirm. Then go to Firebase Collections and update everything in here. And now we can try out our app.
Okay, so first step is that I try to apply for verification. And because I don't have any followers, I am unable to apply. Then let's switch accounts and go follow this user. Now I will log out and try again to apply. And now that I have one follower, I'm able to send the application. Great. Let's accept this on our admin account. And here is the application. Click Accept. Now switch back and see if we have the verification mark. And there you have it. Thank you all for watching. I have to say that I am really glad for your support and requests. I hope that this video will help you in your project. Anyways, thanks for watching, and I will see you in my next video. Have a great day.